Boys and girls, it's Detective Harris, and I'm on a secret mission. Let me tell you what it is. Wait, no, it's a secret. Come closer. No, whoa, that's a little too close. Okay, the secret mission is to find and solve the mystery of the unknown word. To solve the mystery, I'm gonna use three clues. I'm gonna use the picture, I'm gonna use context clues, and I'm gonna use a familiar word. Let's see if I can solve the mystery. There it is, the book. There it is, boys and girls, the unknown word. Pig was feeling fed up. I'm bored, he moaned. Bored, 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 bored. There must be something to do that's fun, and I'm going to find it. So off he trotted. Boys and girls, the mystery word is fed up. I'm going to use the three clues to see if I can figure out the meaning of fed up. First, I'm going to use the picture. Oh, look, there's Pig. He looks sad and upset. Hmm, maybe fed up means upset. Let me try clue number two, the context clues. Context clues are words around the mystery word. Pig was feeling fed up. Hmm, maybe fed up is a feeling. I'm bored, he moaned. Moaned is a sound you make when you're upset. Maybe fed up does mean upset. I'm going to use clue number three, a familiar word. I know what the word upset means. Let me see if I can try that instead of fed up. Pig was feeling upset. I'm bored, he moaned. <gasps> Boys and girls, I think I've solved the mystery. I used the three clues, the pictures, the context clues, and a familiar word, and figured out that fed up means upset. The next time you come to an unknown word, see if you can use those three clues, the picture, the context clues, and a familiar word. Look in a book that you're reading and find an unknown word. Seesaw your teacher and tell them the clues you used to figure out the meaning of the unknown word. Did you use the pictures, the context clues, or a familiar word? This message will self-destruct in five, four, three, two, one.